Hey y'all, so um, episode 4 is out for members only, so, and the initial reaction seems to be that it's pretty damning, it's pretty, um, well, we'll see, I mean, I can't watch it until it goes public, but I will be covering it, for sure, and, um, Anyhow, let's let's talk about uh, this latest bullshit, which was her, I guess she did this live stream today. What are you stop it. Just fucking stop it. Nobody wants to hear your fucking cat calling. It's not attractive whatsoever. Please stop it. You do it. Come come see the people. Come see the people. Come 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 come. And I think I already mentioned to the big girls, stop wearing um horizontal stripes. Um, I mean, that has been recommended for decades. That the larger you get, you should not wear horizontal stripes. Because it emphasizes your width. It's such a dumbass thing to do. Mark. Come. Come, come, come see the people. Mm -hmm. So what's up with the blue um, eyeshadow? Are you trying to be like Janet from Three's Company? Like, what the fuck is going on right here? Yellow. I feel like I need a more hijab. Island eyeshadow. It's a little. Um, it's. I thought it would match. It doesn't. No. Wear a white hijab. I have a black one handy. But you're right, it would. But white hijabs look so bad on me. Walid, why the come salam? I say that like a total non-Arab person, don't I? <laughs> now you guys can see how I do my hijab. I'm not going to do anything fancy with it. But I can't even imagine wearing that m many layers and clothing in a desert climate in the summertime. Like... <laughs> There's got to be a summertime wardrobe for Muslims. <laughs> I just don't get it. Yeah, you know. <laughs> I am doing very well. How are you guys? Mm -hmm. French guns said baby teeth and rubber lips is what a man wants. What? <laughs> I don't even know. <laughs> what? Oh, yeah, you don't know. You don't know what he's talking about? You don't know? Give me a break. You're running a fetish channel. Shut up. Blue teeth and rubber lips. What? What does that even mean? By the way, I just got done watching your, uh, yo mama, your, uh, your stream. Except for the part where you talk about Alex, because I have to fast forward that. I can't stand his voice. I'm such a mean girl today, by the way. Yeah, you're a homophobe. You're a homophobe. You can't stand his voice? Shut up. By the way, hi, happy BJ. This is important to, this is important, all right? This is an important lesson for Girl World. Please stop assuming that just because somebody finds us big girl, big girls, all right? Amberlynn and I, if, we, if anyone finds us pretty, okay? They're not feeders, all right? It's No, there is a difference between the attraction of liking bigger girls versus the fetish of wanting to see big girls eat large portions of food and you know this that's why you're doing it so stop trying to gaslight your audience Chantel very possible for someone to be attracted to someone okay Mm -hmm. Be just because they're big or whatever, like get a life. Yeah. Hi, Isapi, Nike Projock. 
Mm -hmm. I mean, Girl World sh should know they're obsessed with us. Hi, Charles Reed. You made a rage post. <laughs> Nixie, are you like the content police? If I decide to talk, mention something else one time or another, and you're gonna like point it out. You're one of those. Hi, Diaz. I'm from Canada. I live in Kuwait. Hey, hot tea. J Mel. For now, I live in Kuwait. Wouldn't it be cool? I don't know. I think it would be cool. You know what it is? I'm like share on the movie Mermaids. I don't like to stay in one place for too long. You know what I mean? I don't know. Mm. Thank you, creepy killer brows. I know some people think I have fat eye, eye, um, eyelids. They're they're chunky a bit, but this is a brow bone. My brow bone is right here. Are we in you're gonna get it mood? I'm hyper and you're gonna get it. <sighs> Blow up feeder dolls. I wouldn't, I, yeah, imaginary people, yeah, probably. <laughs> so yeah, so cut the crap, all right? Mm -hmm. Stop the cap. <laughs> um, you know, because people can like us and, and for other reasons other than our body weight, like, you know, people will always be like. Yes, they can, absolutely. But you have been paying men to be with you and you have been um overeating online to get some sort of feeder attraction these are different things but yes it is entirely possible for you to meet somebody who is still interested in you despite your size that is possible but um, these are unrelated arguments, and you are gaslighting your audience. I don't know what Salah sees in her, like, you know? And it's like, what do you mean? What do you mean? Like, um, we make it, like, we have, like, a lot of chemistry, and I make, like, I make him laugh. He's never met anyone like me before. Um, and I'm pretty. So, I mean, why does my weight even matter beyond health reasons? Seriously. So, cut the crap that fat women cannot be attractive unless it's for a feeder, which is just stupid. You know what I mean? Okay. Chantel, you know you're not pretty. If if you felt confident in your looks, you wouldn't be using filters. You wouldn't be hiding under layers of clothing. Um, you would have done something about your balding head. Like, seriously you know you're not pretty and this is just your insecurities coming out saying of course i'm beautiful i'm so hot i'm hotter than 90 percent of people on the internet okay girl thank you that's what i wanted to say that's your psa for today yes i didn't attack you nixie i'm pointing at, i'm pointing out that you're one of those people i thought um, you were only doing this i thought you were well obviously if i'm saying something then i change my mind about it <laughs> Oh, Minnie, we're... Yes, I didn't lie. I changed my mind. There we go. As long as we don't show our chemistry in public, so we do, don't worry. It's not for you to see. Hey, Blondie. Are you permitted to wear different color hijabs? Yes. I'm permitted to do whatever I want. <sighs> I changed my mind multiple times this stream. <laughs> I mean, obviously in live streams, I'm not going to talk about food. Like I thought you said that you could at least, like, hold hands and hug each other in public. I never see y'all do that either. So give me a break. I got married at 240 pounds and I'm 160. You can be beautiful at any weight and Islam part of practice is to ignore the ignorant. Yeah, for sure. Hey, uh, Kitty, hello. What's that creepy? Oh, uh, I don't even know what they're talking about. When he calls me potato head, <laughs> yes. Yes, that's our cute little things we have between us, you know? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. For sure. Brenda, I need to ask. Yeah, that's adorable. I would absolutely, I would be so cool with um, my ex boyfriend calling me Potato Head. That would be so fucking rad. My daily question you need to come in and ask it first. That's what you have to do. You know? I see people trying hard to come in here and advertise Mr. Cardigan's loser um, documentaries. And it's just, nobody gives a shit. Not gonna work. I just made potato salad and I was craving. Yeah, but you seem to be really fucking rattled about it. Right? That's why you've been doing so many weird ass live streams and videos over the last few days. 
Because you know it's coming out and you're really freaked out about it. So it came out today for members only. The rest of us get to see it tomorrow. You know what's going to be in it because you know what you've done. Yeah. Uh, yeah, a good potato salad is yummy. Or macaroni salad. <laughs> that sounds really good. Don't ever feel bad about your weight. There's bigger people than you. No, I don't feel bad. Like, obviously, like, if I want to lose weight, it's to improve my health or whatever. But, like, you know, I would say as big as we are, Amberlynn and I are the only ones that have the friggin', you know, gall to show ourselves on camera. So there's that. And that's not playing. Can you stop lying about that? You know that there's a lot of us that show ourselves on camera. Can you please stop lying? <laughs> You know, if you're going to say that you don't have, like, you've lost weight or you don't have that many chins anymore, like, show yourself. You know what I mean? Prove it. It's so easy. <laughs> Thank you, sweepstakes. Timu Prince Harry, who is? Hey, Blondie. Oh, Timu Prince Harry. I see what you mean. No, Timu white underbelly, soft white underbelly. I got a soft white underbelly. <laughs> I ain't going legs. I'm not going to put a hijab. You would never let me do that. What are you doing? Are you proud of mom? She keeps walking past my plaque. You missed Salah in the chat? Hi, Sessa. <laughs> Thank you, Simply Ravishing. <sighs> Zach was call wrong calling you racist for saying Charlie, no friends. That, what? Somebody called me racist for saying that? I missed that part. Oh. Yeah, it was racist. You purposely called Kalari Charlie, no friends in your live stream and that was to be like all black people look the same to me yes it was racist just like your chimpanzee comment please <clears throat> nothing to say <laughs> sorry i was having brain zaps at how stupid that was Somebody not having front teeth is um, a racial thing. But it's okay for everyone to call Salah salad, right? No, I have no kids. The salad thing came from your channel. Not the same thing. Thank goodness. <laughs> Actually, I have a cat and I have a hamster. They're my kids. <laughs> I called her Calamari. I don't even remember her name half the time. I saw many colors of hijab on Amazon. They were really low price, so I'm not sure if good quality. Hmm, it's hard to tell. It's hard to tell if you're ordering. I have tried the carbonara Samyang noodles, yeah. They're all super spicy. Thanks, Kitty Charms. Why would I ever, in, in a million years, let my husband have another wife? There's no way. Two, I'm pretty sure I would know if he had a kid. <laughs> People have no proof. This is the thing. If I don't talk about my life or if I don't, um, I'm not open, people invent things. So it doesn't really matter, does it? <laughs> but I don't know, dude. Is like 30, somewhere between 30 and your age. And it's entirely possible he had a relationship before you and has a child. So that is not out of the realm of possibility that he has a child from a previous relationship. By the way, I saw that people were concerned, like people have been sent me messages, like DMs that they're worried because they saw that, that my building burned down. <laughs> like what? There was uh, on, yes, there was a building like in the same area as Kuwait that burned down. It was really sad. Like, I think, like, I don't know if this is true, but I saw some news sources, like, the numbers always change, but, like, about 40 people died. And it was, like, near us. But, like, what do people do? Just watch Kuwait news for content to, to, to try to make something up about us, like, in relation to that? I don't know. The eyeliner? <laughs> and I have a lot of makeup on. This is, like, really out there eyeshadow. Like, what the hell? There was a fire in Manga. Yeah, how do people know that? They just watch Kuwait news? I guess maybe just interested about the area since I live here. Look at those bat wings. <laughs> came across your news really oh yeah that's really sad though that like really like um yeah king fuzz i was just talking about there's a um huge fire and there was a huge fire yesterday um like just like at fadger time and we went to bed not long after that um 
so yeah it was <laughs> okay soda and sadness you can wait all you want um it was uh it burnt down so like 40 people like died and like i think 40 others were injured or something so that's really sad my heart goes out to them and their families i read about that i was like what the heck do you get bored being at home all the time or are you able to go out on your own mm, i don't know like i really want to try to go out on my own like just have salah drop me like at the mall and just like pick somewhere like a nice cafe and go live and like hang out with you guys hey Reese's, why you too ds was that a labor camp yeah that's really sad i know that the i saw like there was a speaker from the government and they're gonna like try to reform things for people's safety and just like the you know stuff like that it's really wait a minute did she just say that the building that caught on fire in which 40 people died was a labor camp do you want to expand on that for us a little bit please is that oh cool wolf pub nice glad you found it no he doesn't have a kid don't even know why i'm even saying that anyways if people want to think he has kids go for it who cares what if he did i'd be a stepmom whatever who cares anyway so What if he did? I'd be a stepmom. Who cares? Um, well, I don't think you would care at all, right? Because you wouldn't want any responsibility in that particular scenario. So it would make sense that you're sitting in the car eating a quesadilla, right? which was the most offensive thing you could do on Cinco de Mayo, but okay. Um, so you're eating your quesadilla and joking that he's visiting his other wife. Well, and then he said he got a haircut. He clearly did not get a haircut, Chantel he did not get a haircut so what was he doing in that building broccoli cheddar soup yum so i really want to try to go out but yeah millie but i'm kind of like scared because i don't i didn't realize how i don't do anything like alone anymore like i don't drive i don't go out anywhere without salah so like honestly i know it sounds stupid but like when we go out i don't use my brain like i just i have 10 kids from four wives right now Me! People were missing you here. Hey, Duck Puppet. Hi, Teardrop. Oh, nice to see you. Nice to see all you guys. Hey, Kim Richards. So it's not, it's not that I, I can't go out by myself. It's that, ugh, I don't know. I'm afraid to get lost or to like have like a overheat or something. <laughs> and like not know how to use like. You don't have GPS on your phone? For real? You can't figure this bullshit out. There's a lot of us single ladies in the world who have to navigate streets, Chantel. The debit machine or something like that. It's, or what if something happens? Like, because I never use those. I don't do those things. I don't do anything when I go out. I just go along with. I just. I'm just there. I am Vanessa. <laughs> Any plans? Travel plans? Yes. Nokia unfamiliar on the language barrier and honestly when we're driving like it's really packed at night here right in the evenings and it's a small country you could drive from end to end in like what two hours like <laughs> so the traffic jams can be real and there's a lot of roundabouts and the people they don't signal most of the time all right it's just like eh. like you should see Salah drive he's one of them he knows how to he knows how to deal with that traffic like without even it's just so easy for him but me I don't know I'm very nervous passenger princess I like being a princess of some kind. I don't need a personal care support worker. Uh, Uber and Lyft. It kind of feels like it. I mean, you seem like incapable of actually doing anything. I don't, I don't know what to tell you, but if I had to go to Kuwait, I would certainly be driving myself around. No, well we do, but I don't think people use it that much. I don't know. Yeah, it's daunting to drive. Hey, Paul. Priscilla Presley. 
Yeah, who isn't happy when they're eating a good meal? Are you kidding? Just found out our AC can't be fixed. Need a whole new one. <gasps> what? Yeah, that's the landlord. You, yeah, try to get him, Teardrop. That's expensive. I have a gorfo. Hold on, guys. Hold that thought. I gotta go. I gotta go wash him. What? Why? What happened? Okay, who did I miss? Driving for me is a piece of cake. IBS, you guys know me, right? Why do you guys know my bathroom habits? This is not good. <sighs> yeah, Nicole, I'm freaking out all day, come. No doubt to your job. Definitely talk to your landlord because that's like inhumane. If you're renting, they should be fixing that. You could argue that. It's like the heat in the winter, it's necessary. <sighs> you saw an orb? I did wash my hands. <laughs> Don Crew, I know you don't believe me though. I know you don't. What did What did Millie say? Come here. Oh, you're a pretty girl. And tell everybody all the No, I don't think you just randomly ran to the bathroom to wash your hands. I think you needed to go to the bathroom and you wanted to pause your live and um you were hoping that that could be the excuse. And goddamn, get that cat out of your arms. She fucking hates you. People, tell the people. Tell the people. Oh, tell the people. Oh, you pretty girl. Yeah, you pretty girl. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. Oh, okay, come to mom. She fucking Hi, hates you. Hi, Jesse. You look like Endora from Bewitched. Who's Endora? <laughs> Julia's so grown. Are you a big girl? Yes, you are. Thank you. Julia doesn't want to be here? Yes, she does. No, She's what, maybe a year old? She's always brushed. She's always messy hair, kind of. That's not that bad. Little nitty yay. No, it's bad. It's bad. And you need to take her to the vet. Get her vaccinations, get her spayed, and have them either brush out the mats or do a medical shave on her, depending on how severe they are. Hello, Nitty. Thank you for the four gifts. Thank you, Melly. That's sweet of you. Girl in the bees are army. Don't leave me like this again with the other mods. It felt unsafe. What happened? Uh, Thanks, Melly. Was Samantha's mom? The food? You're eating good. She's eating better than us. <laughs> My tummy feels weird. I, don't I never know. watched Bewitched. Her coat seems dull. Aww. Did you hear that? Yeah, it's um. I feed her wet food and dry. I feed her both. I feed her wet food in the morning and then dry during the day. <laughs> what happened? You're beautiful. Don't listen to them. She's too young for Bewitched, you guys. She was born in 84. She doesn't know Bewitched. She doesn't know I Dream of Jeannie. She doesn't know any of those shows from the 60s. Gidget. Any of that shit. Like, she has a very limited... Um, pop culture knowledge it is pretty much like the worst possible shit from the 80s and 90s and that's all she's got don't listen english i speak english i don't speak spanish i know spanish swear words but that's it dry organic salmon food shiny coat maybe i should put more like maybe some more yeah like olive oil i don't know Hey, Julia. I'll ask the vet about that. The last time we, when we took her to get her vaccine, she didn't, he didn't say anything about her coat. You're enjoying it? Uh, I, the gym. I'm not going to the gym. Hey, oh, sorry. Lip gloss. It, oh, you know how to say a whole Arabic sentence? Oh, I bit my scar. Look. Vanessa, hi. I can't get over the eyeshadow. You're making me so self-conscious. You know what? That's it. A cosplay pageant? Sure. Foodie Beauty cosplay. Creepy, have a good day. Okay, guys, that's it. I'm tired of this. Mm -hmm. 
So basically, so many people in her chat complained about the blue eyeshadow that now she's taking it off. Yeah, we don't. I, I haven't been talking about my pet care and stuff like that because people attack me and say I'm an abuser and all this shit. So I just keep everything like that to myself, to ourselves. Like they wouldn't if you said. I'm taking her in for her shots and to get her spayed. If you said that you were taking care of her for normal pet shit that is supposed to happen, people wouldn't be giving you a hard time. Period. There's no need for us to prove anything and there's no need for us to, like it's no one's business, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. But I'm going to ask about your coat if it should be shiny here. What is it? What's going on? Maybe the food? I feed her Astro Cat. What is this? Lip gloss? She's shiny. Are you shiny? You're a bit shiny. Come. Come. Oh, yeah, booze. And by the way, I'm not going to die. I'm going to outlive you, even with diabetes. Okay? My grandma lived to pretty much 80 with diabetes for 40 years. So, yeah. Hi. Up. My cheeseburger eyes. My eyes are. How heavy was your grandmother exactly? What was her weight at 80 years old? Because, you know, my grandfather had diabetes all the way till his death as well, and he died when he was 80. But he was a healthy body weight, Chantel. How much did your grandmother weigh? Is this a fair comparison? I'm wide open. Okay, let's do lipstick. Let me try this one. That's because I want to be lost. This one is higher. Oh, well, this is K2. This one's Mount Everest. You're not shit talk breezy in your presence? What? What? I wasn't, I was saying. Okay, I can't even like outline my lips anymore. No, I don't like this color. What do you guys think? Yay or nay? I think the mouth is Feels like old way. times. Oh, now I look like I have like ketchup mouth. So don't try to find me. What did, oh, KF, decorate. Yeah, I need a better background. I'm so bored of this freaking background. Comic book, oh yeah, sure. This is a lot of hair fiber breeze. Bees. No, he doesn't have to. Look at his hair. It's thick and black. I love it. Can I do top of red? I'm too sexy for this shirt. Too sexy for this shirt. I don't know how it goes. How do you make friends as an adult? I don't know. You do extracurricular activities. You sign up for things, whether it's volunteering for things or in getting involved in your church activities or um, signing up for a book club or, um, you know, painting or whatever it is. You sign up for something where there's going to be other people, Chantel. That is how you meet people. The spare room, make it a vlog room gaming. Yeah, good idea. That's what I've been wanting to do, but... A walking pad, you lost me. The duo lip look. <laughs> Queen Beezer trademark red lipstick between me for... <laughs> you have to be intentional. Yeah, that's the part I... You know what, KF? That's the part I struggle with. <laughs> I had a, the weirdest dream ever, okay? I had a dream that... I was driving in this city. I don't even know what kind of city it was. It's a dream. Anyways, and I had to use the washroom so bad, like, number one, okay? And then, so I went to a McDonald's. Why am I even telling you this? You guys don't care about my dreams. Pubs and clubs. Friends are so basically, this only lasted for a few seconds because you had to pee, right? So you needed to wake up and go to the bathroom and you were in that final REM stage 
where you're just having a few little moments of something before you go to the bathroom. Overrated. Yeah, I have to say. No, I'm kidding. It would be cute if one eye had red shadow. I don't like red shadow. I think I have red shadow somewhere. Snoozy beauty. I should change it to that. McDonald's in the desert. No, that's Burger King. I dreamt about that the other day. Now there's a new restaurant. So there's the desert. Like, I'm, I'm always like, for some reason, I can't find my car in any dream I have. So I have to call my mom. But she always picks up. She, ne she never not answers the phone. That's like, I feel like she's so reliable in my dream. So I have to ask her, where's my car? And she's like, it's here, cutie. And like, you know, and I'm like, I'm coming to get my car. I need to drive. I need to go for a drive. And in my mind, I'm thinking I want to go to the desert Burger King. And then, but then I want to walk, take a walk on this long street. That's like weird. And there's always this one buffet, Chinese buffet restaurant. Dude, I have never had food dreams. Not once. I've never had food dreams. I've had um, horror dreams that freaked me out, that made me wake up. I have had dreams where Pumpkin is still alive and guarding my bedroom as he used to do. I've, I've had dreams like that, but... I have never once um, been asleep and you know I stop eating far earlier in the evening than Chantel does you know so she eats right before she goes to bed which is probably not great for her digestive system I know it became a problem for me many years ago that I cannot eat that close to bedtime or um, the food will just sit in my stomach and it won't digest. And I end up waking up and throwing it up. But I'm certainly not dreaming about food. Restaurant that's open, but then when I get to the buffet, it's all the leftover crappy scraps and nothing good left. We're going camping in the winter. Probably a part where more Western women are known to live looking for other expats. It depends. Burger King and an unreliable, I don't know where my car is. That's such a bad feeling. The desert BK. <laughs> you know what? I, I, don't, I don't think, most of the time I never end up there. I don't know why. It's weird. I don't know. I like dreaming though. And I have, like, it's very unusual, isn't it? To have reoccurring, like, pl like scenes, like places in dreams that are like just always there. Mm -hmm. I don't know. It's weird. And I, I'm never an independent adult in my dreams. I'm always, like, living at my mom's. And, like, relying on her for, like, to find my stuff. Like, maybe that's I don't feel like an adult. I don't know. Yeah, it's weird. Even though I am. Like, I don't ever rely on my mom. Like, maybe, like, when I... Don't you think that that's a... Don't you think that that is a larger indicator that you need therapy? If you keep having these issues of going back to your childhood like clearly something is off about you and um allegedly <laughs> girl if i mean you're always dreaming about your mom taking care of you for real i mean that might end up being what happens because I don't think Salah's going to take care of you when you actually do get bed bound. I stay with her. Like, I stay in, like, between different family members when I go to Canada. But that's it. Like, because I don't live there anymore, right? So. <sighs> okay, I have to go to the bathroom again. I have to, like, really go. Mm. I hate, okay. yeah, when well, you can't find it. Or you're trying to call someone. And the number is just not going. It's not. <laughs> what did you eat on your book? She, uh, I don't think is taking her medicine anymore, you guys. If she needs to go to the bathroom this frequently. Oh, sorry about that. I had something to do. Mm -hmm. What happened? You guys are scared. What happened? Reddit chat. What did you do before? Nothing. Just a bunch of metformin. Ugh. No, I had to do something. I, I just really had to go. So. <laughs> Actually, I was a little. Jesse wasn't me. <laughs> Baby. 
Baby Jane. Ah, <laughs> <sighs> oh, cool, Chai. <laughs> My teeth are mother of pearl. The mask. Why so happy? I have the zoomies. No, I'm kidding. <sighs> and the walls will ooze green slime. Yeah. That was my hand, yeah. You seem more relaxed. Don't pull an Elvis. <laughs> what character? I don't even know, honestly. How do you wear this thing? Is this from The Purge? I think it's from The Purge. I'm gonna get you. <laughs> never naughty that's right i'm never naughty hey charlotte i feel like oh i didn't get to read that the binge the binge burger. no yeah no that's bad looks good on you oh thanks can't see my face is that why <laughs> well we're gonna need like i don't know i think we're gonna need this on halloween we're gonna make a halloween in kuwait <laughs> trick or treat imagine it's um, against the Muslim religion, so I don't know why you're even talking about that. They don't believe in celebrating Halloween. So, girl, you can't have it both ways. Pick what you want to be. Go next door to door for falafels. <laughs> well, that would be awesome. I would take falafel. I'll come out with you to collect falafel. <laughs> Too much makeup on. I just want to be on notch. Let me take my makeup off for you guys. I'm going to wash my face after, but for now, just the makeup part. Let's get in my jammy jams. Oh, yeah. I'm running out of these, darn it. And I haven't seen them anywhere. The Purge Forever, yeah. I don't like it. Ow, this friggin' eye uh, mascara. Why'd you even put that makeup on? What was the point of that? You put it on for this live stream and realized it failed miserably. So then you're taking it off on your live stream now. I don't even know what to tell you, girl. Um, blue doesn't work on you. Waterproof. You like the last purge, so the purge forever. What was that, Soda? Math lesson. Look at the difference. <laughs> Energy egg, happy birthday. Happy day of when you were birthed. Music for what is scary? Use oil? Yeah, look, it's not coming off. That's why I have some on. <sighs> look how tired I look without eye makeup. <laughs> oh, sinister. Yeah. And Ethan Hawk. Um, I'm on the last episode of From, so season two. Is season three out yet? I don't think so, huh? I don't know if he took math. The purge never happened. <laughs> no, but you never know. Dystopian movies uh, kind of serve as a warning in a way. Warning for what? If you think about it. I don't think that, I hope that would never happen. Now I look like dead. Why are you out of breath just taking your makeup off? All you're doing is taking your makeup off and you're breathing heavy. What's going on with you, girl? Oh, that's better. Mm -hmm. I feel that <laughs> doesn't look as good, but it feels good. Oh, yes. I feel so much better now. No makeup. None. Even though I look tired. Hi! Hi! Aww. You're my girl! 
Okay, everybody, take note wow. of my hot sauce, where it is. It's new. It's here. Okay. <laughs> if perch happened, we're going to hide behind... Oh, yeah, the blue window. We just told everybody our secret hiding spot. Okay. <laughs> that was a weird... You could hide there, I guess. Probably. But if you could fit there. I use Starveil. I never heard of that. That's the best hot sauce, isn't it, though? It's like, it's not even that hot, I find. It's like, just more flavorful. It's like chili garlic, and it's like a bit sweet. Erase the big G incident. Oh, gosh, yeah. For sure. <sighs> Saturday Night Live. No. Miss Potato Hedgehog, your name. <laughs> Eyelashes, they're small. Look. Oh, my gosh. They need a freaking... <laughs> You're normally cute and beautiful without any filter, unlike the other mummies, you know what I mean? <laughs> other mummies thank you babe thank you sweetheart mm. well landlord just came and put window units in our house till saturday oh yes see yes i'm so happy to hear that seriously oh that's you can't you can't not have ac not where you are yeah i know in the summer i like arabic music ghost face hi orange bulb she doesn't sleep when i go to sleep i don't think she sleeps in the bed but before, like, uh, when I go in bed and lounge around like a seal for the night, she'll come and lay beside me. Mm -hmm. She'll jump up on the bed several times. Put it on the wall, Stanley. She, she'll come up, jump up and go, eh, eh, eh. and then she'll go for to dad, dad for belly bell rubs. And then she'll come and lay with me. No, you can't. It's a health hazard. Exactly. To your, mine either. Like, Pumpkin would come and sleep. Sometimes he'd sleep with me on the bed. And sometimes he would lie right next to me on the floor, guarding the bedroom door. I guess it depended on how confident he felt in the moment that there would be potentially an intruder or something going on. But, um,. Oftentimes, he would sleep on the bed with me. And um, before I fell asleep, he would want to cuddle with me. He'd want to get under the sheets and be by my legs for a while until it got a little too hot for him because it does get warm doing that. But... Um, He was always protecting me. Julia, if she does cuddle with them, she's doing it for Salah. Because it's very clear that Chantel has no relationship with this cat. I wouldn't be able to stay here if we didn't have central air. No way. No way, Jose. Miss Potato, there's three parts of the Mummy movies, and the best one is the first one. <laughs> you like the first one, eh? I don't like the Mummy. No way, Jose. That's interesting. One of the trolls that showed up during my Chinese mukbang was named Jose. Hmm. That's a kawinky dink. I mean, like, it's, it's like mindless entertainment, but it's not something I would watch again, I don't think. No way. Boring. <laughs> Sorry, babe. There's not many movies I would watch over and over and over, except for The Shining. I haven't watched that in a long time. Mm -hmm. um, I don't know. Ghost World used to be a movie I watched all the time. Because I, I felt like I, I felt like eating it a lot of the time, because I felt like I didn't know what the heck I wanted to do with my life. Like, I felt lost. Like, everything sucked. I just thought everything sucked. No heat. Listen to Hesed. Okay. Ghostface, I'll try to remember that. Salah. <laughs> Journey to the center of the earth. Yeah, and they both have that Brandon Fraser guy. Same actor. Looks like you're on the wrong side of the river. What's that from? Journey to the center of the earth? Ghost world. I know, right? Isip? The Blacklist. Is That's a TV show, eh, Barbara? Yeah, I really liked that movie, mm -hmm. Ghost World. And what else? Steve Buscemi was awesome in that. And um, what's her face? 
forget her name, Sora Birch. And that's like the only thing I like Scarlett Johansson in. The quote from the mummy one. Ah, oh, okay. We have some mummy fans. We're gonna we're trying to get through. I, I, we've committed to watching the Saw series. Julia, you're on camera. Well, sorry to uh, interrupt you licking your whatever you're licking. I don't want to know. Jeffrey Dahmer kick. Oh, yeah, it's depressing. Because then you remember it really happened. And like, I always think of that. Like, I'm so weird. I think of these things. Like, when I cut my finger a little bit, I feel like there's people out there who've been victims of serial killer and had their whole bodies chopped up. And I feel like that's like, that's surreal to me. <laughs> like, I don't know. I was watching a true crime thing um, recently, I can't remember exactly when, where um, they found out, the, the two kids found out that their mother had been hacked to death and body parts were like stored in the fridge and stuff and the uh this is really sad actually because i don't know where he was gonna go with this you know but the the older son asked if her head could be reattached and i don't know if that's just so he could do something better for her in like a I mean, you can't do an open casket in this situation like that, but obviously he was thinking something. I don't know what he was thinking, but um, he wanted his mom's head reattached. And I just, <laughs> I mean, it's, game over when your head's off your body it's game over guys period <laughs> mm -hmm. is it normal for cats to be looking at she's is her leg in the air she's cleaning her yes she's cleaning her whole body your cat is doing the same on your lap no not as frequently as she is on your live streams. Nope, 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 nope. Take her to the vet, Chantel. My cat, yeah, she usually once a, I always see her like at least once a day, licking her butt. You've never seen Beetlejuice? Go, go, Alatol, directly. Is that right, babe, that word? Alatol. <laughs> go now directly and watch it. Yalla, sada. <laughs> that's, oh, you're scaring me. <laughs> that's the cat. <laughs> 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 Look at Julia's face. Oh, you are so cute. Look at her. Whimsy Lorley, welcome to Loyalty Beezer. Thank you, Whimsy. Welcome, welcome back. Because I brought you a Beezer before, I think so. Right, you said, Beezer. <laughs> that cat is so cute. It sounds like he's pushing out his, his he's squeezing out his cries like, Bleh! I saw her face. And then they show the girl in the closet and it's like, <laughs> like, what does the lady from the well do? I don't know. Like why she makes you look all contorted. Oh, I didn't know that, Nixie. Julia's so cute. Thank you. Yeah, she is. Oh. Oh. There you go. I don't like to hold her too long because I know she hates it. <laughs> she doesn't like to be picked up nope. too much. I know you don't like to get you. The ring impression. It's true. It's like... <laughs> Stanley was a, a mod for a long time on my channel, wasn't weren't they? Yes, you, I think you were. So that's why I just remodded them because they were a mod. Why? Who's, are you guys fighting or something? <laughs> I don't always notice. You give me troll skills vibes, not mod. <laughs> I used to love Fear. Fear was the first PC game. Yeah, hot tea. It's real, I love it. I played it on my Xbox. But new shirt. Thank you. Could you imagine? Look how how it die. It's like a really the neckline is really uh, long. So, put our shirt under. 
I watched on Netflix Evil Dead Returns. What? Is it Is it a new series or something? I thought he was trolling. I don't remember the rages, Stanley. I don't. What did you say, babe? I wish I could read Arabic. He calls out all the lies on the losers. Yeah, exactly. Your mods are on to me. <laughs> You're a troll? You're a troll mod? A <laughs> 16-ounce tub of yogurt as a side dish. It was an individual yogurt. Hi. Hi. Hello, Are you excited for Saw 4? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I can't wait. <laughs> yeah, right. You're going to fall asleep. <laughs> <laughs> no way. No way? I'm fully awake. See my eyes? <laughs> no, if Stanley is... <laughs> I'm missing. Stanley is uh, not Ariel because they speak Arabic and Ariel is not Arabic. I don't think so. <sighs> yeah, I'm Barbara. You two having a date night? Yeah, we usually have one every night, I guess, if that's like our normal routine. Every night in... Hi, dream. Well, not dreams. In the real life. <laughs> Yeah, really. Look, 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 look. We do. Look at her mouse. Oh, you're sweet. Look, it's treats. She like her toys on mouse. Yes. Me. <laughs> <laughs> Brenda, it rhymes. What does that say? I'm the Ayah. I'm the Jamia. Oh, Jamia. Hello, everyone. Like, welcome, everyone. Oh, I don't know that the numbers in the Arabic. <laughs> A theme to mukbang. Yeah, I want to do that, but I made a face at him. <laughs> the table. It's the one leg is loose, so it always creaks. Oh. Yeah, but don't sleep on the. Don't sleep on it. More furniture broken. How do you all? I'm coming to your town. Hey, Stella. Ma'am. <laughs> <laughs> you look like tourist. <laughs> Doesn't even fit my fat man. How come? What's the trick to this? <laughs> no, I always do it. Don't worry. <laughs> wow, dude. I, I can't. This is so fucking boring. Let's just get through it. <laughs> my lady? There's a snake in my book. <laughs> How do you do it? We haven't even tipped it, like, my lady. <laughs> the Taiwan hat. I think we still have it, eh? <sighs> Somebody the Taiwan! The Thailand hat. Charlie Chaplin. <laughs> you need a piece of wheat. <laughs> well, I've been farming this old farm for about 45 years before my... Before my... No, what was I going to say? <laughs> Well, I've been farming here at this farm for four to five years, and before me, my daddy would do it. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what's in Translation. <laughs> no subtitles at all. <laughs> can I sing a Mexican song? Actually, I can't. I don't know Spanish. I'll, I know about. Tequero. Tequero? Yanni, uh. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I know. Down in the West Texas town of El Paso, I fell in love with a Mexican girl. <laughs> I had a hat with an ice cream, yeah. Your Mexican. I love Arabic songs. Hola, como My ex used to do um, Spanish songs for karaoke, and he would use my computer to do it. And so now, every once in a while, when I get commercials on these videos, they're in Spanish. <laughs> I do not speak a lick of Spanish, you guys. Bueno. 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 Feliz Navidad. Yeah, everyone knows that part. But that's all I know is Feliz Navidad. Dino Whatever. Ciao, come here. Buonasera, mi amore. <laughs> yeah, remember that first video you did? You said the said hi in like every language. Oh, that was a long time ago. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you wanted to say hi to every nationality that in my mm, audience. Yeah. Good memories. Yeah. <laughs> and one of the first things you did on camera, you're like, here's your Burger King, baby. 
Remember? I was I was amazed. It was uh, natural. Sawadika. <laughs> Sawadika. Sawadi cap for man, right? Yeah. Well, I don't know. Sawadi. <laughs> talent, open talent. Hi in Beezer language. Oh boy, we need a Beezer language. Good idea, Meep. So we have to create a new uh, dictionary for this language, Annie. Yeah. Tamam. Tamam. Lishla, why not? <laughs> Lishla. Shukran F1. Latinas are beautiful, absolutely. Burger King is an F for DC. Double Chicken Royal. How come the hat fits you? Do you ever get nervous going live in front of so many people on live stream? No. Because his head is smaller than yours is. Come on. Let's do it still. Sometimes I don't feel like it though. Like I don't feel talkative. Yeah, I've been doing this for a long time. I'm tired. Where's the next travel destination? Ah, uh, we can't say. No, <laughs> it's gonna be a surprise. It seems teenagers, yeah, a new season was just announced. For what, Euphoria? It's basically your life before you went so Hi, big man. Hi, big man. You, big man. You, big man. Hi, big man. Oh, you, big man. Here's Harry. Hi. What are you doing, Howie? No, he has the same spot here. See, it's the same out. It's the same Howie. Harry, Howie. Do you hear a cheese coming? You gonna have a piece of cheese? <laughs> this is cheese slice. See, there's already a corner missing. Here we go. Look. Look. No, don't put it in your cheek. Okay, I'll give you another small piece. Here you go, Hal. Don't choke. There you go, that's all you get. Yes, you love the cheese. <laughs> Look at him eating cheese. Do you like your cheese slice? He has his own cheese slice in the fridge. I just, but the corners get a bit dry if I don't cover it properly. Yes, guys, the hamster image in the chat, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you like your cheese slice? You didn't have your cheese slice today. You didn't have cheese today. He's binging cheese like mother, like son. I only give him a bit of cheese. He's like, give me the whole cheese. Now this is going to go back in the fridge, his cheese slice. Anyways, um. Okay, I got to go because uh, I need to uh, uh, take a call. So, um. No. Harry and spaghetti. Okay. Gotta take a call. Right? Like I did on Monday night when I found out that I had a leaky toilet. Okay, you gotta take a call. Um, I'll see you guys later, okay? Um, thank you for hanging out. And uh, we'll see you guys again soon. I will, I'm gonna go out sometime and like uh, go live somewhere else, eh, babe? Yeah, sure, why not? Special. What's that, say? Lishla. Lishla. Why not? Lishla. Yeah. Lishla. <laughs> Adios. Hey, Sabri. No, it's not my cat. Bye, everyone. She's still eating the cheese, the little piece of cheese slice. <laughs> Bye, guys. Bye, Duck Puppet, Melly, Vanna, Teardrop, everybody. Adios. See you, guys. See you and, later. Uh, good night, all. Bye. Okay. Bye.